<coughs> Lately, I've been starting my broadcast with a cough. So, um, <coughs> speak, excuse me. It's not the way I plan on starting this, but anyway, I want to be on time. So, this is my daily broadcast. Welcome to my Facebook Live at 5 p.m. Pacific time. Did it again the right time today. Um, before I jump in, well, let me just tell you, episode 674, the, episode, the topic today is how five minutes a day can, will change your life, and I'll explain that in a moment. Before I jump into that, let me choose myself so you know who I am, what I'm about. Um, my, name is, my name is Barry Selby. I'm a best-selling author, inspirational speaker, and help women create balance in love, life, and business because I'm a passionate champion of the divine feminine, which also leads to these talks I do every day called Messages for the Masculine, Inspiring Your Feminine Heart. I'm actually in the middle of a women's weekend. Yeah, I actually start a women's weekend, which is kind of fun to do, and a good chance to hold the masculine space. I'm going to pop right back in, so I'm going to keep this short because I'm not on a break right now. But I want to do a quick talk um, about this little topic because I've been talking about this for a while, and I was talking to somebody earlier today in the, in, the week, in the weekend event because they wanted to get my self-love practice. I'm, yes, I'm promoting my self-love practice, so you can tune it now if you don't want to get it, but listen first. And I started realizing talking with her is about how there's this, this piece for ourselves that we are... Um, how do I say this? We are the sum of our parts. We're a gestalt. Like who we are is more than just one thing at a time. And the reason I'm saying this is because what I realized when I was talking to her about the self love practice is that when you do something like a practice discipline in the morning and the evening, if you do meditation, if you do the self love practice I'm going to recommend, if you do exercise, if you do certain things five minutes a day, the ripple, if, the, the ripple effects are what's key about this. The ripple effects will pan out through the whole day. And the reason I talk about that in my work with the self-love is because it is a powerful and potent teaching. Because when you do that, it will start to in infect, affect, and create results in every area of your life. So this is a quick reminder and a quick nudge that if you learn how to do this for five minutes a day, you end up doing it for 24 hours a day. And if you want more love in your life, this is how you do it. This, this practicing self-love, whether you do it through your own practice or what I recommend in my own meditation, you will transform your experience of love, of life, of everything. And I'm keeping this short, and this, this is going to be probably my shortest Facebook Live ever, because I've got to get back in the room. So this is a quick summary. Um, and I want to do this now because I want to give you this input so you would have this insight. Because we need more love in our lives. And if you're looking for love in all the wrong places, if you're not someone who's really focused on the self-love practice to really undergird your dating life, you're missing out. Self-love is a fundamental key we can all give ourselves. And most people don't. I've talked about this a little bit before, but I want to give you a little distilled version because the reality is self-love is such a simple tool. But the thing about it is we don't do it because we think that somehow, well, either one, we don't think we can do it, we don't make time for it. Maybe we don't think we deserve it. We think someone else is going to give it to us. And we play this game where love is never ours to have and own. We chase love like it's out there because somehow it's some elusive thing like a butterfly we can't catch. Which to me is insane. I did it myself so I know how insane it feels. When we learn to love ourselves, instead of being exhausted from chasing this elusive thing out there, finding a date, finding a partner, finding someone to love us enough so we feel whole, we can relax into who we are as love. We can own our love, our own respect, and we can be fully immersed in love every single moment. Why well, I'm saying the five minutes a day thing piece is because in, my, in the guided meditation I have, there's a five minute morning meditation and a five minute evening meditation. But what I'm aware of is that it's not about, the, it's not about just the five minute meditation in the morning and the five minute meditation in the evening. It's everything in between. Because what happens is, if you do the self-love practice every day, within a few days, if not the first day, you'll start noticing that your actions will start shifting towards more loving without even doing anything. This simple, and it sounds simple, practice of self-love, because self-love is actually simple. It's about remembering who you are, loving yourself, appreciating who you are. My practice is a bit more detailed, detailed now, but that's the fundamental piece. And when you do that, then you notice that maybe you'll do something different when you're in traffic. You're driving and suddenly if something cuts you up, you won't jump into reactions quick. You may just go, you know what, I'll let them go. Or if you're in line at the supermarket, maybe you'll let someone go ahead of you because you're not in such a rush. Or perhaps you'll help somebody across the street who needs some help. 
or you'll simply make more time for yourself during the day and take a chance to take a step outside the office and breathe in the sunshine. All these sorts of things happen when you start thinking about yourself as valuable and loving, which is what self-love is really about. Introspecting, appreciating, honoring, accepting, caring for yourself, supporting yourself, I mean confidence in yourself, all of these things. And it's yours in this very moment if you want to do it. So I'm going to put a link in the comments for the practice. You can check it out. And uh, I'm going to basically keep you on track if you want to take it on. And with 30 days of practice, it will change your life completely. It will change your whole framework. And yes, if you're single, I recommend this highly because it makes you more attractive for a relationship because you're no longer going at them to give me the love, give me the love, which some people, that's what they do. But when you get to the place where you love yourself, you come off as abundant in love and more attractive because of it. So it's a double-edged benefit. It's <laughs> a double-edged double tool. It's a double-edged benefit because you fill up with love first, you don't need anybody else's love. And when you're out, being out in the world loving more often, people will find they love you more because you're more attractive, more joyful, and more filled up with love too. It really is this simple. You just gotta do it. So I'm gonna sign off because I didn't want to get back in the room. I know it's my shortest broadcast in a while, but I'm at this event, so I wanna get these broadcasts in as easily as I can at 5 p.m. If you haven't seen my broadcast before, I do these every day at 5 p.m. Pacific time on my personal page on Facebook, which is facebook.com forward slash Barry Selby. The replays go to my business page on Facebook, which is, face, which is Barry Selby author, And then they also go to my YouTube channel, which is uh, Barry Selby, if you haven't subscribed to it. Um, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel. And the list, sorry, the playlist is called Messages from the Masculine. These I do every day at 5 p.m. Pacific time. Usually I may do it tomorrow at the same time if I have time in the schedule. It's what I do. Um, and this is just a quick nudge. I'm going to put a link in the comments. Check it out. If you like it, grab it. If you don't, it's fine. I just want to make sure you have the thought about it, the possibility of loving yourself more now. So when you're in a relationship, you actually add to the love rather than sucking on the love. I'll leave you to ponder that one. Questions, thoughts, please put them below. If you're not only wish to watch it, please share it with them. And thank you for being with me as always. This is my daily broadcast brought to you by me. <laughs> so I'll see you again tomorrow, same time, chat and channel. We'll see what we'll talk about what we'll talk about then. Everything is new every day. So um, this one's a bit of a rush one. I, pretty, I, I I'm not apologizing. Just that I've got time for. At least you're getting some. At least you're getting some thoughts to think about. Um, without, see you again tomorrow. Take care. Bye.